the Ledger Nano S. You want to claim your Bitcoin goals? Let me show you that right now. Hey, how are we doing, everyone? Once again, this is Dario from Media Box. If this is the first time on the channel, you can hit that little M right there, and then you become part of Media Box ENT Universe. So you have one of these, and you want to claim your Bitcoin goals. I'm going to show you that right now. All right, so let's check the instructions how to claim your Bitcoin. All right, we're going to follow right from the Ledger website. I want to remind you, I'm not responsible. If anything goes wrong and you lose all your Bitcoins or any other token you may have in your Ledger. So let's talk. First thing here says we need to install the application Bitcoin Goal 1.1.16. 1, 1. We do that in a minute. But before that, we got to make sure we're running the latest version of the Chrome app. So the best way to do is just go to the store here. And we're going to search for, say for the Ledger Wallet. We're going to launch it because if we're going to start it here, it's not going to show you. The version so we need to do is just click on it here all right see you can launch it for you we're not going to do that now and we look if we have the latest version so we do it's actually even higher the one to run it anyway i think this should be updated automatically we should worry too much but you can double check do not execute it from here because if you secure it from here it's not going to show you the version next step we're going to make sure we run in version 1.13 so let's look into the so we are in settings, right in settings, we press the two button this and the top. And if we go down, so if we place place device, we press the two buttons. We press the two buttons and the top. And we click in firmware. I said we got the latest version. One, three, one, we are perfect. So the next we're going to install the application. To do that, we're going to go and we're going to execute the ledger manager. So when you're ready, you go all the way down and you're going to install it. Um, it happened to me in my case, I was full because I did have too many. I did have Neo, but I didn't have any tokens on it. So I just went and deleted it. I'm not sure what happened. If you do hold in some token, if you delete it, I don't know how you can claim it back. So before you're going to delete anything, I will back it up to another um, temporary wallet in case you want to claim the gold and you are full. So maybe let's say you got Neo, well, I will transfer it to another type of wallet, Jack wallet, whatever, transfer the tokens, then delete it, claim your Bitcoin gold, and then you either sell it or transfer it to another uh, wallet if you want. You can do that too in case you run out of space. So you're going to install it. After install, I said that's done. Let's change the instructions back again. So we do this, we compare. Now we install the application and now we're gonna launch the Bitcoin. So we go into the apps and we're gonna execute the Bitcoin. That's it, now it's waiting for me. In that case, what we're gonna do now, so now we're gonna go and we look for Bitcoin Gold right there so we're going to press the two buttons in the top and open now pay attention here do you see what it is i'm going to point it right now right over here i'm going to put an arrow anyway you see this has become split display tools what i find out is every time you need to execute you always need to go here because if i go either in, in segway it's not going to show me that so i need to go to the split tool it's going to split it for you. It's going to take a little bit. So you come here. Now, if you're holding in Legacy, then you will have to click Legacy. And if you're holding in Segway, you will have to click Segway. I will say if you got anything in Legacy, you can move it to, to Segway. Or you can execute one and execute the other one. In my case, I think I have a little bit there. Let me see if it shows. Let me try that. So let's try this for the first time. I think I have a little bit, like a few bucks. So let's try uh, Legacy. It's going to split it right now. And let's see if it shows me anything. Takes a little bit of time. First time, first time you split it, it takes a little bit of time. 
this time it goes faster. It's already split uh, the segue one. As you see, take some time, and yeah, that's something. Let me see, BTG, like I said, you see what I have, 0 0.08 BTG. So if you have anything on legacy, then you have to split in legacy. If you want to split now your set way, you're going to go into settings, and blockchain, and now you're going to click again, split again, split two but this time you're going to use Segway so you click Segway again first time it's going to take a little bit of time so every time you want to get your coins you're going to have to do this every time you want to get there is not a special tab for Pico and Gold I guess it's only in the split tools so when you go Segway you wait and now it's going to show you whatever you have in BGG so we see now what I have for Pico and Gold now, I want to show you this too. Now, after you split, you say, well, I don't have to split anymore. I can just go on Legacy and Segway. So look what happened. Even if, let's go and click Legacy. And if I go and click Legacy, you remember I have some there? And then I split the two. Angels, zero. So you always need to split. So to get your Bitcoin goals, BTG, always you need to go to the split tool to go back either Segway or either Legacy. All right, bye.